What's up you guys and welcome back to my adventures in Hawaii. In part 6, we step into the crater of a volcano and head to the southernmost point of the US. This is by far my favorite part of the entire trip. So many cool sights and a few really special moments with some of my closest friends. With all that being said, let's get started. This is the only one that's actively steaming and venting, at least. Mauna Loa is active too, but it just kind of like shoots out a bunch of uh, lava when it feels like and then shuts down again for a brief time. People lost their houses, people died for sure, but yeah. Mauna Loa erupted back in just over a year ago. Um, but that Mauna is such a big mountain that the, the lava flow, by the time it stopped erupting, the lava flow hadn't even reached any kind of population. So it didn't even get to the highway. We took in the majestic view from the top and started our journey down to the bottom. Rip. It makes these like white raspberry like fruits that yeah, to my knowledge, they don't taste like anything. Ooh. But you can try it if you'd like. Do you mean not taste like it has no flavor? Yeah. I'm good. Cool. Oh, peckers. Oh, oh. <laughs> we had two, two doinks. It's kind of like a cucumber. Yeah, in, in the sense that a cucumber tastes like nothing. It's like after quite a bit of hiking, we finally made it down to the surface of a volcano. Oh, we have made it to the caldera of a volcano. It's like a wasteland out here. <clears throat> Let's see. Parentage. Yes. This is not edible as far as I'm aware. <laughs> but it looks cool though. It has seeds inside. Yeah, little tiny baby seeds. Oh. There you go. I'm forgetting the name of this plant. I want to say it's Aali'i. It's it's a Hawaiian native. I think it's Aali. Let's look at that for Aveo Veo. <laughs> One of the two. <laughs> I'm still learning. <laughs> this is insane. Right? You are presently in the caldera of an active volcano. Of course. How casual. You're completely casual, and nobody else is here. Oh. Yeah. Thanks for coming fucking through. Oh, yeah. Pretty. Ooh. Fucking shit behavior. <laughs> that Unbelievable. is wild. At least throw it in the volcano so it, you know. Exactly, exactly. Well. We just pick it up. Oh yeah. Yeah. Pleasant. But I'm, but it is pleasant. Really? Oh yeah, you get the. <laughs> <laughs> Sun's out, guns out. <clears throat> yeah. Oh yeah. He's trying to pick up all the gay boys. We should take a photo. Us standing behind the danger do not pass thing. Oh, cool. yeah. yeah, I have one of just me doing it. But we can go Being able to set foot on a volcano is truly one of the craziest things I've done in my life. At this point, I thought the day couldn't get any better. That is, until we made it to the southernmost point of the United States. We'll come back up. Oh, how far can we go out? Like, I guess we can go climb on these rocks. Shit, you're right. <laughs> Flip the camera around. Oh, and I got just that. We've now made it to the southernmost point of the United States. I mean, technically, there's like the continental 48, 
which is in like Key West, but this, this is like the real southernmost point. And my God, do my boys look majestic. Majestic. Let me take a photo of them, hold on. Wow. Oh, yeah. Whoa. I knew they were somewhere in here. That was awesome. That was fucking awesome. I guess we'll hit the rocks to the right, Lewis. Up over here. Uh huh. Oh, no, I'm just gonna follow you guys. Scanning for Mexicans. So what was Smith's logic that they'd be sailing this that way? Well, they're, they're moving in uh, this to the left. It makes more sense to be on the left side. I mean, who knows where they are now? They're the water. Hard to say. How long can they stay underwater for? Once we were done looking at whales up close, I got to fly the drone around for a little bit. The whole area was rather windy, but I was still able to get some pretty amazing shots with it. Then Ryan decided he wanted to jump off a cliff into the warm water below. in for the jump. Smith joining in for the jump. Look at them come back up. Aren't you proud of them, Lewis? Lewis is very proud of them. And now they're coming back up. Look at them. I believe in you. I think you have good enough grip. Smith making way for his jump. Ryan Weisskopf already down there. Here goes B. Smith. Oh. Oh. Woo! Let's go! Look at him go. Lewis is so proud of them. Oh, I 100% I wouldn't do it. Yeah. Let it be known. Like, <laughs> like, hold on. I gotta, I gotta pull the wrists off so I can actually, you know, talk to the fucking camera here. But no, I've done those jumps before. Like, back home in Georgia, we have jumps that are the height of probably like twice to three times the size of that height. And I said to myself, after I did one of them, I was like, all right, I'm never doing that again. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Um, yeah. I was thinking to myself, I'd rather skydive than do that. I wouldn't skydive either. I'm terrified. I feel like terrified there's, a, of heights. there's a higher chance of risk or in, risk of injury for me doing think? this than skydiving. I think because I know oh, wow. if I you know jump off at a slightly wrong angle, God forbid.
of it, I belly flop. Ooh. Yeah, that, that then, would not be good. Then you're but, but let's give a round of applause to the boys here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I got to do one more. Nah, Ryan has to yeah. do one more. From all the way, way at the top. All What's the way up, at the top. <sighs> all right, then. I guess we can see Ryan do it. From the top. Come on. Before this battery dies and I have to put the other battery in. Ready? Oh, I'm ready. All right. I was born ready. Jason born ready. Here he goes. One, two, three. Woo! Nice job, Ryan. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. And just like that, B. Smith yeah, shocks us all. <laughs> all right. Love it, boys. <laughs> no. <laughs> You'll pull up? <laughs> no, no, no. We capped off our day with a beautiful view of the sun setting off the coast of Hawaii. It's going to get copyright infringement, but I'm just going to go ahead and put uh, Uncle Ivan's song is behind it. As you guys look off into the sunset, the sad one. Yeah. That leaves from the vine. Yeah. This is a happy moment, Tom. Nope. <laughs> Not okay. as sad. No, nope. we're making it, it sad. sad. If you want to make it sad with music? Be my guest. It's going to get copyrighted, but it's a. Of course. It's a happy. That's moment. the goal. It's been a wonderful day. It has been a wonderful day. It's been a wonderful day. We're halfway there. It is Wednesday, my dudes. I think I'm second. I'll drop you two off at the same time. I think you're a nine, you're the most favorite. Unless you want to sit in my car for two more hours. <laughs> After nine o'clock, there's still nothing to do with God. <laughs> well, I have to, yeah, because I'll have to get to the airport a little bit before then, obviously. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Yeah. It's ridiculous. Right at your flight. Right onto the plane. When the plane is taking off. Yeah. <laughs> you just grab on the plane. You just go right onto the plane. Damn like, straight. Like people in India grabbing a train. You know? Yeah. Can I tell you guys, after the DC trip, like when I was going to catch my flight, mm -hmm. Kelly dropped me off a little late. Uh, oh, yeah. And I like had to run through security, run to the my gate, and I was the last person on. They had closed the door already. Uh -huh. And I was like, please, like, can you just let me on there? She was like reluctantly like, okay, fine. And I get on, and everyone's like, "So this is the last guy." <laughs> Everyone's like, <laughs> the door and they, "They closed the door and they let me in because they just oh, had yeah. closed the door." And I would like spend some time looking for the gate. I was yeah. like, "Where the fuck's the gate?" Yeah, uh -huh. track it down, get on. And everyone's like, "You know, give me the stink eye." And I'm like, "At least I made it." <laughs> <laughs> this day for me was truly special. It was easily one of the best days of my life. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to join the Bridge Gang. Don't forget to comment down below what your favorite part was. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye!